Hey, hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. This is day six of me working on it. I decided to take a few days break though between days of working on it. So I mean, they're separate days of recording basically. I wanted to rest my voice and uh, mind of sorts, you know, get the commentary back up to snuff. But... I had some problems in between that I would like to discuss while I go through here. Basically, people were telling me where secret exits were, and this is supposed to be a blind run. And, well, one of them is in this one. I, I can't deny it. I know where... It, well, I don't know where the secret exit is in this level, but I mean, I know that it's in this level. But basically, people apparently were not getting the concept that this was... or is, or was supposed to be, a totally blind run. Well, I use the term blind run loosely here because what I planned on doing, I mean, not what I planned on doing was, because I know the structure of New Super Mario Brother Wii game, I mean, New Super Mario Brother games well enough, to the point that I would know, like, you know, that levels are self-contained and stuff like that. So, I, I, I figured that I would use each level as like sort of a checklist, so I already knew that I would be able to collect everything as I go, or I would just go back to a level or two, because you know, you can tell pretty much when you collect everything in a, in a level, so it's not... So while it's blind in the sense that I don't know, um, you know, the level designs, the coin locations, the secret exit locations, etc, etc, I, I know the game enough to know that I could do a walkthrough on it because I, you know, know the game series enough about it and whatnot, you get the idea. But the, the point that I was trying, I mean, the thing that I was trying to do in this walkthrough was to show, you know, that you can figure things out logically if you just look at things. And that's, that's something that I try to do on my channel in general is, you know, try to show you the logical way on how to do things. And why am I breaking those blocks? I don't know. <laughs> but anyway, um, so when people kept telling me, you know, where the secret exit exits are, I, I got kind of, I got, I should say, I got really frustrated at that because of the fact that, you know, I, I intended done this to be a 100% blind run and whatnot, so, uh, well, you know, in terms of where secret exits are and stuff like that, and I figured that the logic that I tried to show people how to use and whatnot, you know, it, it kind of went to waste, so to speak, because I, I figured people would have more common sense to know that a blind run means don't tell me where stuff is, you know, that that sort of thing, but so I'm more disappointed than anything now in that people just didn't get that concept, because as I said, I, I try to teach in my channel that I, I like to show things logically and whatnot, and yeah. I'm still looking for the secret exit, though. I don't know where it is, and I hit those blocks before, I know. So it's, it's not there. <laughs> oh, and, uh, um... Consider this quote-unquote walkthrough, this blind walkthrough, more of an experiment more than anything, because, you know, my usual walkthroughs are much, much more organized. So I figured that um, I, I would try a little experiment here by doing a game semi-semi-blind and... And you know what? I see... Did I go up there before? I don't know if I went up there before. Because I see there's a ledge there. Hmm. Hmm. Well, there's a bunch of coins. Um... Hmm. This is... Interesting. I should have brought a shell up here, like, maybe there's a... No, it couldn't be a, a vine over here. This is what I mean about using logic. Like, you see, if you were to hit one of these blocks, it could uh, contain a vine, but since there's something above my head, the vine couldn't lead anywhere, because the vine wouldn't have anywhere to go. That's what I mean about trying to teach people logic in... Wait, what? There is... There is a hole... Do you see that? Hold on. Oh, Because I jumped around up here because I noticed there was a ceiling and I, I, I was trying to see if there's any holes for like those vines over there and I just... Ooh. <laughs> so maybe this is it? Perhaps? Quite? I... <laughs> not sure? <laughs> uh, this looks different than what I was doing. Yes, it is! There's the secret exits. Now, it apparently leads to another level. 
and then that apparently leads to a cannon, as I said, because people decide to spoil stuff for me, and wasn't using common sense, and I'm very disappointed. Wow, it goes all the way there? Holy poop. <laughs> well, okay. So, yeah, I'm going to see what this is. This is actually an Acorn's Plains level. I thought this was going to be, like, skipping over to the Sea World, or maybe it will. I was expecting it to be, lead to, like, a cannon or something like that, or maybe that's going to be a cannon. A cannon spot or something like that over there. Oh, and people already told me that there is a sh uh, secret exit on the ghost ship as well. As I said, yeah, I, don't, I know some of the locations, but I don't know where they are in the levels. I just know which levels they are. But anyway, blooper secret lair, apparently. So I guess we are going to find some bloopers. Just guessing, and... Oh, I thought we were going we to be walking here, but we are apparently underwater. It didn't look like water at first. Yeah, I knew these were going to come out of the pipes. I, I remember them from other... Mario games, or new Super Mario games. Uh, I still don't know if you can actually enter one of these diagonal pipes. Hmm. And, uh, you know what, maybe... Uh, I'll leave what's in that box, because I might need it for later. That's probably a power-up. I don't want to lose whatever is in it. So... Anyway... Uh, yeah, I really don't have any mu anything much more to say here about the whole uh, blind issue that I had there, other than me being disappointed that people weren't using the common sense I've been trying to teach this whole time on my channel. Uh, well, that's the disappointing thing about it, I suppose. But I, I suppose not everyone's going to use common sense, so I guess that's inevitable. Uh, a funny thing, actually, that I, I should have taken into account that I completely forgot about that the situation reminded me of, is way back, Rao Kao did a game <laughs> did a game called An Untitled Story, and uh, people kept spoiling stuff for him in the same way that uh, people were spoiling stuff for me. And what eventually happened was... Oh, come on! I want to go down there, because I know I can go under there to get the coin, based on the way this pipe looks. But anyway, people, were, people kept telling him where stuff was, and what happened was... He got fed up with it, and he eventually disabled comments for it. You can actually look that up on, you know, the video descriptions of that uh, Let's Play. So, and, and I fully understand him with that, because, you know, he wanted to keep stuff blind for himself, as well as for others, and... Yeah, it's, it's a kind of an issue. And, did I miss something around here? Or, can I go in both of those pipes? I don't know, or maybe I'm gonna end up at a different section, because, because I'm missing a coin somewhere. <laughs> Oh, come on. Oh, I should probably follow the pipe that way. Maybe. Yeah, another thing, as I said, want to teach the logic. Go in the direction that the pipes are spinning, because that is where the current is coming from. And I am getting pushed away anyway, but that that's the way that you want to go, basically. Go, 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 I wonder if there's going to be something in that pipe over there. See that in that corner? I wish I had my fireballs. <laughs> I'm thinking there's something here. There is. Just because those coins were leading to it. It seemed like a really out of place spot. Alright. Oh, blooper mama. <laughs> I'm not gonna get those coins. I'm out of here. Those little ones and the big mamas hurt you. And I hope those other ones despawn or at least stay down there. Anyway, I got all the coins. And... Oh dear lord. I hope this is the way out. I think it is, because the other ones have currents. Mm, that was virtually painless. Uh, anything in here? No, 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 okay. And I know I'm low on time, but let's just see if I can get the top score for the heck of it, even on that 99 lives. Oh, that sucked. <laughs> awesome! <laughs> what do I get this time? Not too shabby. I prefer the acorns, of course, but I am not complaining. Although I did see an acorn back at the uh, uh, first world. Okay, where does this lead to, actually? Wow. <laughs> this is going all over the place. So this skips all the way... 
to the jungle world, I'm guessing? Yeah, it looks like it. Ah, okay. I see, so it doesn't lead to a cannon, but it leads to... I, well, I mean, someone told me it was like a warp, but I, I figured it was a cannon. Yeah, that's gotta mean something good, right? Yes, it, it has to. I mean, I hope I'm not 100%ing this for naught. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to discard that, and yeah. Let's see here. And I'm at 10 minutes in the parts, but I'm gonna take this path just to see how Mario looks walking across it. Yeah, that's definitely pretty secret. <laughs> yeah, okay, okay. I'm gonna use this cannon because I still have more time in this part to go over to the next place and look for the secret exit there. But since I don't have anything to talk about during this level replay of sorts, uh, I'm looking for. Um, wait, 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 wait. What is that? Not that one. Um, Looking for the level name, but yeah, since I don't have anything to talk about during the uh, the level now because I already got that out of my system, I am going to take a peek see around the level myself and then cut to whenever I find the secret exit. Yeah. I think I'm gonna dump an ice flower. I got plenty of them. Mm, they're drastically in my way, but basically I want to go over. Oh, I managed to avoid them. That's awesome. To which stage is it? Not that, because I was a mushroom house. Uh, this one! Alright, I'll see you by wherever the exit may be. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! I thought I would try that because I remember that other spot in this level being like a hidden thingamabob. And I, yeah. <laughs> So I decided to duck slide through it because I thought there might be something blocking me from entering that normally. I can't get in there, can I? I'm supposed I'm probably supposed to be Tiny Mario in this particular area, actually. Uh, but doesn't matter if I am. No, it's not! But that is the secret exit, wow. <laughs> but yeah, I remember that other obscure secret in this level, and I figured there would be something similar in it, so I just kept duck sliding into um, statues like that, and sure enough, and looking at the, the map, logically here, it actually looks like that there would have been a path there, because if you look straight through here, yeah, it looks like that there that those uh, rock or sand formations or whatever there point out that there's a pathway there, so that kind of did hint that there was a secret exit there. So this is apparently a part of the desert, but it's not actually a part of the desert. Piranha plants on ice, layer cake desert ice cube. Apparently, <laughs> uh, is this gonna be one of those prana plant ice melting levels like in New Super Mario? Whoa! Do I want them to melt those out? I think I do, because there might, for all I know, there might be something here. Melt this one, please. Come on, there might be a coin. I beg of you. <laughs> I know there's coins there, but I'm talking about star coins. Okay, there's nothing there. Don't melt that. Eh. Well. Did I miss anything by doing that? Does, does it matter if I did? Maybe not. <laughs> I don't know what was the point of that platform up there, unless there was like a, a vine of sorts. Why did I do that? <laughs> I don't know, I'm just gonna skip that. And Oh, wait, that blocks that pipe, doesn't it? And that's that probably has something. Yeah, you know what? I'm just gonna suicide here and restart this level. So I <laughs> because I, I'm feeling that I'm missing something here. So, yeah. Oh, I didn't notice that Aurora over there. Ah, uh, the Aurora Borealis. A beautiful formation in the night sky. Okay, <laughs> back to the level. Mm, yeah, I'm gonna just rush through here. Well, maybe not rush through here, but since I know, you know, I, that I didn't miss anything in particular, but I would like to stay on that upper platform if at all possible, and I would like to keep my power up if at all possible. So yeah, I'm gonna try to get... Well, I failed. I was gonna say I'm gonna try to get up there to that platform, but okay. What's in here? I don't know. It's probably something, because it got blocked off by that cube. Well, that's the first one, I'm guessing. Yep. Dang, ice cubes, the bane of my existence. And these coins, maybe you're a little risky. 
if you get there late. Wait. Shell for that. Yeah. Oh, that's evil. I bet you there's one in each of those little alcoves. <laughs> okay, burn that one, please. I bet you that would squish me if I... Oh, yeah. If I was under them, but I mean... I, I'm happy that I found a little secret here. Uh, uh-oh. Now that's two... Why did I do that? I wanted the wall kick off the... But I ended up backing away from the wall for whatever reason. That was cowardly. <laughs> Don't fall in a hole, please. Thank you. Don't fall down these things either, please. I, I would be appreciative of that. What's up here? Oh, I missed it! Oh, I'm... I'm... Oh, there might be something important. In fact, there probably is something important. I could always come back here with a squirrel suit, I suppose. Uh, wait, burn those, because that's a two-block thing, indicating that there's something that you can use to get up there, I... Hmm, that's interesting. This is an interesting level in general. <laughs> this is like, there's so many other... There's so many things that you can do. You either uh, try and rush ahead to try and uh, get up on top of things before the piranha plants burn the ice underneath, you know, melt it down and then knock the blocks off down below. Or, wow, where is this going? <laughs> Holy poopers! Oh, so that's what that hole in the wall was. It wasn't a secret exit in the ice world, it was a secret exit off of here. Well, not, not this wasn't a secret exit, but... Uh, anyway. But yeah, there's a, there's a bunch of ways that you can play this level. It's really well made. Like I said, you can you can either wait for the cubes to fall down, or you can try and get on top of them. But maybe I should have grabbed the power up before I entered this level, because you know, like a um, fire flower or something like that, so I can manually burn stuff. Oh, that's just the one up up there. Well, that's that's that, I suppose. But anyway, I'm gonna rush up ahead past where the second coin was. Oh, wait, 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 wait. That that block there. That block there. <laughs> I don't know what's in there. It's a one-up as if I need it. So I'm gonna try this now for the fun of it. Yeah, I figured there would be one in each of these things. Oh god! <laughs> oh, wait, that, that was actually worth it. And the green ones don't give me one-ups all the time like I thought they did. That's good to know. So I guess they have the potential of giving you powers as well. So that was where the second coin was. So I'm assuming that I want to rush on ahead and try and get up here! Maybe. I don't know. But I'm going to try and stay up here if at all possible. I don't care about the hit. <laughs> that worked out. Oh, jeez, I thought that was going to be a hole. You know, a bottomless pit. Okay, get to the end and end off this part. <laughs> and oh, actually, I'm going to do that little... I'm going to walk down the... That icy slide that we've seen there that I unlocked after beating this stage for the fun of it. Now, does that mean I got all the star coins in this world? I'm guessing I did. Yes. Yes. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna see how this looks. Whee! Can I actually go back up the slide? Yes, you can. Because <laughs> I know it. Oh, there's Nabbit again. Dang you, Nabbit. I'm tired of chasing you down. <laughs> So that, that also leads to this very same spot, so both secret exits that I found in this one lead back to the uh, soda jungle here. This very same square as well. Mm, but yeah, I think I'm going to end off the part here. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next part when I go flop over to the ghost ship of this world. <laughs>